So we were trying to take the hubcap off and was not coming off. We thought these were fake and hollow, but I noticed that they needed to come off. We looked on YouTube, but he said there was only two, but I found out all of them need to come off, actually. Yeah. Well, so I've special. gotten all of these off except this because they're going to change my front hub assembly. Your whole brake system? Yeah, and the, the calipers, right? the brakes, everything, the rotors. So yep, so we're trying to take that, these right? off. Don't need to take them off now, but just take the. Oh yeah, I'm not gonna take so them off. So they all now. have caps on them. But but we weren't, we back didn't back know. Like all of them off. It's just this last one. I seen it wiggle, so this last one is being a butt. <laughs> Thought this was just a hubcap that just pops off, but no, it's bolted on. So see, you have to take it off these these caps and then take off the bolts. See if we can get these other ones off. So we got it off. Yay! All done. Now we need to do the other side and the rear. They're going to be changing the brakes tomorrow. And also, I'm going to get new tires. Yep, so everything's being changed in here, which I'm glad for. And I'm buying new tires and new rims, so I don't have to mess with these rims anymore. All the brake parts cost me $600. We got all that. Um, one of Scotty's friends gave us a discount, his AAA. Plus, he um, works for Napa, so we got a good deal on all the parts that we had to place. We um, bought the whole hub assembly, which is awesome. And, oh, sorry, that made me tired. Anyways, um, so they're going to replace those tomorrow, and the guy's only charging me $150 labor. That's awesome. Alloy polished rims. And they're supposed to be really lightweight. It's just going to be better. I don't have to mess with all this junk when having to replace a tire. And also, I changed them to 16s. But the tires and the rims cost me $3,000. That was really, really expensive. But I don't mind because Panda needed a new pair of shoes. Okay, so Scotty was using brute force in a... I, think I was just them off. Yeah, he's <laughs> <chiseling. laughs> So I'm trying to just take them off easier. But it doesn't matter because we don't really need these anymore. Nope. So <laughs> this is how hard they are to get off. If you said a curse word, it wouldn't be too bad. I got it. Oh, you got See? that one. Oh, <laughs> yay! Hey, you're it. Yeah, well, you're chiseling. You didn't have any of them Chisel. off, did you? You're just chewing them up. Because you you interrupted me. <laughs> <laughs> I was almost there. You're like, I'm sorry. No, it's okay. Okay. Sometimes. Homer, she was working real hard, so you gotta let let her get down. <laughs> she completed and uh, yeah, she you, you almost had it. <laughs> Arr, arr. Are you a pirate? No, but I you just done. get them. Oh, awesome. Oh, you got the easy ones. That's what happened. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> got the easy ones. Oh, look. Dang. Oh. Look, it got. Oh, you got it down. Yay. Awesome. This is what Scotty did to it. Chisel and hammer. Uh, and oh it would have taken me a while. Well, see, awesome you? job, Aja. Thank you. Awesome, awesome, here's awesome. Bye bye. Wow, well, look how rusty those bolts are. Yeah, it's that's been a while. This, this is all. Yeah. Steel on it. It's all that I wonder if when you were supposed to. All that to, moisture gets in there. Yeah. But does it have a dot? It has a dot there and a dot there. Yeah, they all have there. dots, though. <laughs> right. That's why, because we saw oh, a video hit. and it said, look for the dots and you take off those two, but it's not just two. It's okay, all here of we them go. on mine. Okay. Here's all the ones Aja took off, and here's the ones. That... Yeah, see, there's mine on nice and neat. Look at that one. Scotty! I don't have any. Scotty, be, be the tip down. <laughs> Thank you, though. Thank you, though. Yeah, we're not saving them, so they don't. it doesn't really matter. There's the other ones. Yeah, I'll give you some WD 40. So we're going to go ahead and soak these rusty bolts down, so that way tomorrow it should be easier for them to break it because it's usually hard to take rusty bolts off. All right, I've also replaced my old license plate light. That thing had it. There's the brand new one with an LED strip and a nice new casing. Your old one was ugly. <laughs> That's what? 
That's not even really that bad of a rim. It, it still can be. Oh, you around. mean where it's bent out like an inch? Well, you just have to. <laughs> just Are you sure that doesn't look bad? Kirk, oh, yeah, just kick it. Oh yeah, that'll get it back in place. Oh, I didn't say I'd put it on my rig. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that was complicated. All right, we'll see y'all tomorrow for the brake job and new tires. <laughs> The oh, old, oh, in with the new. Perfect, perfect. Awesome. Yep, looks exactly the same. No more rusty stuff. Here are some of the parts that I've purchased that they're gonna install today. Oh, it's so nice to be having some new stuff. No more rust. I know, don't those look nice? I know these are here, the hub assembly. All pretty shiny and brand new. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> She's like, what's going on here? <laughs> what's going on here? So here it is right here. Doesn't that look nice and shiny? <laughs> pretty. An alignment, yeah. I was going to probably do that when I get my tires. Tire one off. Here's the old caliper and the brake pads. This brake pad had a little bit left on it, but yeah, it was definitely time. Time to change it. This one it was right there at the squealy things. Oh yeah, <laughs> little spider building its nest in there. <laughs> yeah, it has grooves in it. So this is the old hub assembly and the rotor. Installed, okay. Oh. And didn't stop. <laughs> Is that good? You could have come on by my torches. <laughs> you definitely got them on. Wow, look at all that rust. <laughs> we thought we had it down. Oh, One more thing. Breaky, I forgot. There we go. <laughs> oh, <that's nice. laughs> All right, now time for the driver's side. It's all the way out even with the the living compartment. Yeah, that's that. This one's been replaced, I believe. Please shorten it. That's why they have it. Now we can turn the wheel all the way to the right. Okay. <laughs> do you want to do it, Scotty? It's no. okay. Thank you. Tools. All right, so what are you doing? We're gonna um, pack the bearings. And okay. so this is a, um, a grease bearing packer. Okay. So yeah, set it in oh. there, screw it in. Make sure the bearings sitting level in there. Then you just oh, put neat. that down. The grease gun again. Yeah. Just ooze, out. yep, yep. So what I'll do is I'll do a few more and then it should come out the sides. And then I like to also uh, do a little hand packing in there. See how it starts to really come out? Right. So then we just... That's messy. Yeah, it's fun. <laughs> just want to make sure you get lots of grease packing in there. And it just fits right in there. Yep, and then you put a seal. Oh, cool. Which I'll uh, make sure we have plenty in there. All nice, shiny, and brand new. Yeah. That's 
so I just need my little hammer and a bar. And then just press this in. Yep. All sealed. Oh. Oh, neato. And that is the finished product. And so I'll just, all I'll do now is just do the same thing to the bearing. Oh, this is, that one goes in here? Exactly. It'll go right in there. Okay. But there's not a seal that holds it in, so you don't do that until um, after. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's coming right out now. Yeah. And, just, and then I'll hand pack it a little more. And then you can't put it in until we put that on. Uh -huh. And then you, um, then you put slide that. the last one on. Yeah. Okay. Because this is the outside part Dang, it's doing where the, the rim attaches to. Correct. All greased up. So they do charge you a uh, core charge for the hub assembly. So I need to take this back because it's like thirty dollars. Let's see. The old brakes have the oh. Yeah, see that's a ribbit. Right. Type. To let you know it's time to change your brakes. Yeah. But well, the, it's not. It's. It's not that. It's not there for that. There's a scraper. Yeah. A lot of times, and it's probably on this other one. Uh huh. And and you'll hear that, and that tells you that you're done. Oh. The okay. rivet is how they held this on. As to the new ones, they'll bond them on. For right. Some, you know, is how yours are. So I mean, my, my new but, ones were the same way. But sometimes some of, some of these rivets are, are higher. Right. And boy, I tell you, I, we had one where it got down to the rivet and it just tore the, the rotary up. Right, <laughs> yeah. All that dirty stuff out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it should be flushed. Yeah. Crap. yeah. <laughs> this is where the brake fluid goes. <laughs> Packing things. I'm going to this cap a little tight together. You got a grimy you can take that lip off with? Yep. Yep, yep. Gosh darn it, Doc. Sorry, I let you down. Where's my helper? I was packing the grease. <laughs> Yay! I'll go clean her up. Straight okay. out. Yep. Got a ball peen hammer. Yep. A little body work. Yep. Dust cover. Let's see, we kind of got a little right. thing on it, so I'm just going to. Put it back to straighten it out, yeah, yeah, yeah. It and that's what, what inserts here. Exactly, right? exactly. It'll go on after everything's on. It's a dust cover to keep the dust bearings. out of the bearing. Right. But sometimes they can be very sticky. Oh man, ready? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Heavy. <laughs> Not if I was twenty-four. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it looked pretty heavy. Yeah. Well, so, see. It's so heavy. Yeah. Yeah, they have some grooves in them. Um, but that's that's but probably the good side. This is probably the, the side that got worse. I feel how it's lipped up. Oh, yeah. I mean, you possibly could have turned them at the same time. Then you're looking at, by the time you spend to have them turned and all that, uh -huh. then, you, they, they, yeah, then you're, you're buying new bearings anyways. And, right. And, you know, I mean, it just time-wise, it's just not cost-effective. Right. And now you have one, you know. I have brand new ones that aren't rusty. Exactly. Because look at those bolts. They yeah. are, they're brand really. Yeah. Rusty. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, this one is wood. Yeah, the other one is wood. But they cut the wood right. See, and then you put it right. <laughs> this was done. Oh, was it undone? <laughs> Well, you got a black spot on your shirt. That was for me changing oil on my own truck. Oh. <laughs> that's, that's one thing diesel does, man. That, it is nasty. Friendly rag. Hey, I'm going to eat some grease. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I don't, I don't think it's draining anymore, but. It doesn't have to be clear to the top either. Right. You want to leave it about a quarter inch? Put that cap on it's not going to come oozing out. Oh, so wow. this is where the old <laughs> hub assembly was, and the new one's going to slide right on that. We hope. No. Yes, <laughs> getting it all cleaned off. I'm getting dirty! <laughs> I think there's only one dirty one. No, because see, this came with two, Yeah. and we got one with each caliper. Yeah, you get two. Oh, you get two. you know, okay, so we... Okay, okay, well, I'll, we'll figure it out as we go. Is this thing open? Yeah. Wiggle it one more time. 
Okay. Oh, there. it's on. It's not wiggling. No, no. You got it in there. Yep. I got it in there. See, this one has uh, the deeper. Oh, yeah. This one has more brake pad than the other yeah. side did. That's <laughs> weird. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Moo Moo, are you passed out? Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to disturb your nap. I'm taking a nap. And that nice sun. The rotor's on. All they have to do is put the calipers and brake pads. Yeah, we can go up. Up? Yeah, please. There you go. Oh, maybe a little more. Oh, okay. Um, Down? <laughs> no, I need that. <laughs> Lug cap. Cap and stuff. Here you go. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, you know what? What I should even uh, hub cap goes on first. Doesn't it? Yeah. Does hub cap Before this? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we did the other side. Okay. Oh, you know what? I didn't pay attention. I lined up for the uh, uh, for on. the filler valve. <laughs> yes, I did. <laughs> I can put no air in that puppy. We're taking that kind of part. I know. But I didn't pay attention. I guess they're taking off anyways. I can't even think about lining. Oh yeah. That. But we just want to make sure that clips on. Nice to have two. This thing kicks butt. It's an old one too. I wanted yeah. to trade that. That's six hundred dollars. They don't want. They don't want. It was only gonna give me like a fifty dollar trade, and I said, oh, "I'll keep it for that kind of money." Six hundred dollars. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This is where being fat helps. <laughs> yeah. It looks burnt out, but it's not. It's, it's still kind of. Yeah, I need to replace it. Awesome. It is all done. Yay. <laughs> Start it up, pump it up, make sure it's not drifting. Alright. To the floor. <laughs> <laughs> there, I'll put down there so you can see your pump it up. Oh yeah, they, they feel nice. There's no uh, looseness in them at all. Huh? They feel nice, there's no looseness in them all. They, they feel really pumped up. A lot, a lot, a lot. Awesome. Oh boy, now you really stop. I know. <laughs> Thank you. I'm just gonna look at this real quick, Doc. Was I was it, just double, the double check and make sure that was all good. So, uh, okay. you should be set, sweetheart. Thank you. No problemo. Well, the brakes are all done. It was $150 labor plus the $600 on the brake part. So I spent about $750 for all that and now I have to take my um, hub assemblies back and get the deposits on those and then new tires. Hey you short little doggy. <laughs> it's like a full size dog with short legs. What do you want girl? Huh? What do you want? What do you want? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh Poopsie. How are you today Poopsie? <laughs> She's like, uh, oh, I'm uninterested. Girl. <laughs> Girl does remind me of oh, shush. Simon's dog, Champ. Shush. Loud and vocal, aren't you? So I was confused. These I don't take back. Calipers that I take back. Yeah. Plus we had 
uh, just a, this, a few extra stuff, right, that we need to take back. So you can get your money back. Truck is all loaded up, and we are going to haul this stuff off. Ain't nothing gonna break my stride. Ain't nothing gonna slow me down. Oh no, I got to keep on moving. So we're gonna take this metal, the scrap metal, and take it off to recycling. I was trying to take that pin out. He really could use it for us. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot about that one. <gasps> <laughs> yeah. A lot of metal that came off a of panda. And you didn't want... <laughs> well, we're done with all the other errands, and they just called me to tell me that everything's in. So I'm headed there now to have my new rims and also tires installed. Awesome. Well, I've made it to Le Schwab. So goodbye old tires and rims. They've taken me over 35,000 miles. There goes Panda. They're putting Panda into the bay right now. And it's just an hour wait or around there. Bye Panda. <laughs> Here's the rims on the driver's side and the rims on the passenger side. That looks freaking awesome. All that's left is to either get a paint job or wrap Panda. Here's a closer look at the tires. I got the most expensive all-terrain tires that they had. It's just beautiful. Even the spare is nice and new. Looks awesome. 